Sarah, it's early in the morning. Oh yes, good morning. <laughs> <laughs> but I wanted to come here before any people are out. I love being out early and yeah. seeing sights. Mm -hmm. And let me tell you, I came to Jerusalem many years mm -hmm. before I ever saw this piece of stone. And the reason was because I've never seen him come look at it even. Yeah, it's pretty in the corner, like it's kind of hidden. Yeah, it's used yeah. as a base for a light post of yes. all things. Like a regular light post. Yeah, and it was only when I was reading a book about sites in Jerusalem, and I read about this, I've mm -hmm. never seen that, so I came and found it. And so now I always come and I sit against that with this new since they put in this year. I may not be able to do that, but I love to sit there, talk to the group, and then get up, like to pretend we're gonna leave, and then say, hold it, does no one want to ask me about this? <laughs> so, what is it? It is something that was for the dedication of a leader okay. of the 10th Fratensis Legion that was stationed here. They're the group that conquered Jerusalem. Jerusalem. Yeah. Started by Octavius, who became Augustus Caesar, who mm -hmm. you know issued the decree that led to Joseph and Mary going to Bethlehem and so forth. So, and they existed for more than 400 years, okay. and they were stationed different places in Israel. Uh, they were stationed at uh, Ptolemais, at the north part of the country, and they were stationed at Beth Shan, okay. and they were stationed at Jericho. Jericho for winter time. Why? Because it's warmer there. It's warmer so, there in the wintertime. Yeah. It's low down mm -hmm. by the Dead Sea. So that's a good, that's where Herod had a winter palace. So, but they were here longer than anywhere else. And their headquarters basically was just to our south. Herod's oh. palace is just south of us. And they occupied that area all the way around towards the Dung Gate, which would be the end of the Cardo Maximus. And so that's where they were. You can see, oh, by looking, you can see there. Marcus on it. You can mm -hmm. see Maximo. You can see Leg, L-E-G, Leg, the, yeah. and Nus, something. And then you see down there an X, 10th. Mm -hmm. And so... Um, Do you think they're describing? They're describing the, their legion that was here okay. and dedicating this to their leader, apparently. We're not sure. But, and not every letter is there, but enough is there that we can know what that is. And today, a light post. Yeah. Are there more of these out there, or? There are dedicatory things other places. Oh, okay. In Jerusalem, mm -hmm. nothing else quite like this. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. But just imagine if that was in America. I know, we would not be able to, it would be behind a glass. <laughs> exactly, be behind yeah. glass. You wouldn't be allowed to walk up That's and just true. touch it. Mm -hmm. And so, very, very different because we're in a city that has a history that's thousands of years yeah. old. A lot of things that are very valuable, very precious, mm -hmm. are not treated as such. So.